Uh, we find bottles and uh, old cans, sunglasses. Nine divers dove to the floor of the Indian River today in search of trash. They found a treasure trove of bottles, cans, tires, and other various car parts. And some of the trash found has been there for almost a hundred years. Well, back in the old days when they dumped things in the river, I don't think they really had the environmental concern that we do today. Randy Stewart first organized the Big Splash event four years ago. His goal was to clean up the Indian River with help of the community. The Sheboygan County Sheriff's Department stepped right in to help keep the waters clean. Uh, you know, people just don't realize, you know, the water we have in this state and how lucky we are. And it's so important to make sure that they carry a garbage bag with them and they, they just keep the garbage on their boats and don't let it go in the water. Today's dive only cleaned up a small portion of the river. You know, there's a lot of trash on the bottom that needs to be brought up. And that's what we're here for and that's what we're doing. Trash or treasure, the items on this boat will be heading to a better place than the river. All right, Cleaning up the Indian River, Nathan Edwards, glasses. 7 and 4 News. Have some old milk bottles. Beige is the